Dear student, Assalamu alaikum. Hope, I hope all of you doing well. In advanced econometrics, today we are going to explore the Ramsey reset test. Learning outcomes. In this video, we will learn what is Ramsey reset test. Steps involved to estimate the reset test, null hypothesis, f-test, and decision rule. Model specification errors. One of the assumptions of the classical linear regression is that model is specified correctly. What does correctly specified mean? By correct specification, we mean one or more of the following. For instance, number one, the model does not exclude any core variables. Number two, the model does not include the superfluous variable. Number three, the functional form of the model is suitably chosen. Number four, there are no errors of measurement in regression and regressors. Number five, outliers in the data, if any, are taken into account. What is outlier? If you wonder, remember, the large extreme values and the small extreme values in the given data set or series. Number six, the probability distribution of the error term is well specified and number seven the regressors are non-stochastic so what is the Ramsey reset test the Ramsey reset test the test was developed by James B Ramsey as a part of his PhD thesis at the University of Wisconsin Madison in 1968 and later It is published in the Journal of the Royal Statistical Society in 1969. Ramsey had proposed general test of specification error called RESET, Regression Specification Error Test. Here we will illustrate only the simplest version of the test. To fix ideas, let's consider cost output example and assume that the cost function is a linear in output as consider the following model yi is equal to lambda plus lambda 2 xi plus mu 3i where y is equal to the cost or total cost and x is equal to the total output this is the model one now if we plot the residual of above mentioned model obtained from the regression against y hat the estimated y hat from this model we get the picture shown in the figure below look at the picture this is the plot between the y and mu that is the error term on vertical axis we take the y hat uh, 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 mu hat and x axis we take the y hat the residual in this figure show a pattern in which their mean changes systematically with the y hat i this would suggest that if we introduce y hat i in some form as a regressor in our model it should increases R square and if the increases in the R square is statistically significant it would suggest that the linear cost function was misspecified this is essentially the idea behind reset now we look at the steps involved in reset as are as follows the step one from the chosen model, we obtain the estimated 
y i that is y i hat for example is if we want to check either our model is correctly specified or not we check deduct the model specification error through the ramsey reset test and first step is to estimate the y hat number 2 return the previous model by introducing y hat i in some form as additional regressor from figure we observe that from previous figure we observe that there is a curvy linear relationship between mu i hat and y i hat suggesting that one can introduce y hat i square and y hat i cube as additional regressor thus we run y i is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 x i plus beta 3 y hat square and beta 4 y hat cube plus mu i this is the model 2 that we are going to estimate so number 3 let's r square if obtained from 2 b r square new and that obtained from 1 r square old we use the f test that is given below simply we can say that previous both models we obtain the r square and test uh, statistics use that is the f test so f test is equal to r square new minus r square old divided by number of new regressor over 1 minus r square new by n minus number of parameters in the new models so this is the test that is that is we use so what is the hypothesis number four if we compute f value is significant say at five percent level one can accept the hypothesis that model is misspecified that is the null hypothesis is equal to model is correctly specified so p values of our estimated model is 0.9573 what is uh, which is greater than the 0 0.05 we do not reject our null hypothesis so our model is the correctly specified here is the uh, e views output of ramsey reset test uh, look at the f test the probability value of the f test is 0 0.0.9573 and our null hypothesis is model is correctly specified if the p values are obtained from the f test is less than or equal to 0 0.05 we reject h h naught so here we do not reject h naught we are unable to reject h naught because our p values are greater than 0 0.05 which means that there is a no uh, our model is correctly specified uh, here are some reference we use to prepare this lecture the uh, uh, basic econo econometrics by Gujarati and the original paper Ramsey 1969 the test for the specification error in the classical linear least square regression analysis published in the journal of the royal statistical society uh, and another important book is the uh, written by the william green that is the econometric analysis and the uh, introductory econometrics a modern approach by waldrich uh, thank you for your concentration